Avril Khan called me and asked me if I would be interested to stage an opera. I'd staged before three operas and that were not my most positive experiences, I must be honest. <laughs> so I was very hesitating. But I said to Avril, well, you know, my problem with opera is the same I have with theater, is that we're actually playing for an audience which is very nostalgic, you know? They want to have it like, it like they know it. And I said, to my opinion, there's only one way to avoid this, that is to create something new. Ik zou dat een soort pandemonium noemen van geluiden, stemmen, flarden, muziek. Ik denk een weergave van hoe de psyche werkt, associatief, uh, herinnerend en teruggrijpend naar heel veel lagen. In die zin dat uh, het onder andere elementen bevat over de Eerste Wereldoorlog, maar ook geluiden of fragmenten die met de natuur verbonden zijn. I liked actually the idea to make a step into the dark like this text described, to search for an adventure. This music was not composed yet. Let's wait and see what happens. It's not a story. It's not something you can grasp. It's actually something which confronts you with your own now. What, what we are seeing is a kind of reconstruction of past and present. So we start with you moving like this, singers come to the front and go back with Haya told me, I'm so curious what you're going to do. Me too. <laughs> I'm very curious. Uh, I've learned the last years to trust the love we developed together for what we're doing. And from this love, things will happen. And I'm, I'm pretty sure good things will happen.